What's up people, it's your camera boy Jonah and I actually just finished uh, making a tutorial about the uh, aperture priority mode and in this tutorial I was also kind of talking about my problem with perfectionism I wanted to make this video already for three days but I'm kind of like very perfectionistic and well that's why I just never liked the setup that I was in like just create because I, I don't even like the setup that I have now, in my mind it, it sucks, it sucks, I should throw everything away but the most important thing is the information was valuable in my opinion and well you know what, I decided to make this one like very easily at the moment I'm on the G7X Mark II so this is the audio of the G7X Mark II normally I use a Rode Mic Video Go um, and like paired with like the Canon 6D and some uh, 24 lens maybe like 24 2.8 but this is one of my um, videos where I give you guys a free preset and I was actually thinking normally I try to make it a bit special do like some little effects what's up people it's your camera boy Jonah today I want to make an exciting video namely I'm gonna and, and I enjoy it, I enjoy doing it, I enjoy putting a little bit of effort into the videos but actually what is it about? It's about me sharing things that I create with you guys and for free so this weekend I shot at a Tomorrowland festival which was pretty, pretty awesome, it was an in intense experience that's maybe if you check the video of the um, of the aperture priority you can see that I have like kind of like big eye bags so that's why uh, my sunglasses, I lost my uh, my favorite pink ones on the festival well anyways, so I'm here to give you another free preset and this is the preset that I made for my pictures on Tomorrowland and normally I, I kind of like a more like grungy or desaturated look but like, you know, it's a, it's a sunny festival, it's cheerful so they want to have like a warm uh, summery vibe so this is a preset that will match pictures like this, of course. You don't put it on a, on a picture taken in the snow. I mean, you can always try it and never know. You might sometimes be surprised uh, which presets work or what. But in general, this is for like warm, happy, summery vibes. So I'll show you guys. I'll jump in the computer right now and I'll show you guys how I made it. And yeah, enjoy. Yo what's up people, so I have this picture here from Tomorrowland and as you can see I kinda shoot the subject a little bit underexposed Why? Because it was like really uh, sunny So that what, that's uh, how I retain the detail in the sky and I don't blow it out completely So let's apply the preset Alright, as you can see it's uh, pretty cool from the start uh, But I, want, I wanted to take this picture because I want to still make some adjustments to show you like don't just apply a preset and leave it there make like small adjustments to, to make it look even better so for example I think it's a little bit too wide still the highlights so I bring them all the way down then I will even up the vibrance the vibrance is gonna make like the all the, the colors popping a bit more and like leave the skin tones a bit more intact if you go up high in the saturation it will have a lot more effect on the skin tones as you can see here but I mean it's a girl from Brazil she can have like some tan so that's why the 20 let's bump up the contrast also to 50 so I think this already looks way better than the start from the preset maybe here with the temperature we can like do maybe even like this so it gets like really warm and summery so yeah that's cool um, tone curve like as you can see it adds this little fade and makes it a bit more contrasty by just having like a nice S curve actually in all the channels I didn't want to have like too much fade in this picture um, and that happens right here in the shadow area so if we lift this like this you know it gets more uh, faded but we didn't want that here HSL um, yeah just playing around with the use and the saturation of them 
to create this effect also like the luminance and for the rest I'm not going to like go too much in depth uh, into the preset you can check it out yourselves I wanted in this uh, tutorial let's say I wanted to show just how to make like little small adjustments to make the preset look the way it really fits the image enjoy <laughs> what's up man <laughs> Yeah, well, so I was making a video and like uh, I was talking a little bit about what we were talking earlier and I said like Well, I was kind of feeling lonely like the the feeling that um, Everything you make you just kind of think it sucks and you're like Ah, this is not good enough and I could have done this better So tell me what you told me like when we were talking then down to I travel Peru for a month now um, I've been in photography for six months so when I started traveling the one thing that I noticed is pretty much that whenever you come to the school as spot you're just busy with getting the shots you want that perfect shot you want it to be nice you want it to be awesome and you're just not enjoying the moment you're not enjoying like oh wow I'm here in Machu Picchu seeing one of the new wonders of the world I'm like yeah I want that dope ass Instagram page <laughs> tonight and I want the likes and like it's hard for me personally to find a balance I think it's it's kind of controversial it ruins the moment uh, additionally to that yes after traveling Peru for a month and making a travel video about it there's yeah it makes you think like oh damn my shots are just shit I could have done this and this it, I did way too much of for example just zooming around with my camera and yeah it could have been way better yeah right yeah then again, mm -hmm. then again maybe the rest of the world might think it's fucking dope yeah that's true and also it's like you just have to kind of go out and create and just see and with every movie you uh, or picture whatever you improve a little bit and like yeah it's you kind of have to have fun with the process, I guess. Now, I just wanted to put it, put this in the video, kind of for other people who maybe might feel like uh, like they're alone with this feeling. Like they already know now that two other people have it. <laughs> so yeah. Something, I guess. Like um, yeah, I mean, it's a learning curve. Uh, as long as you keep doing what you're doing, you will improve. That's how it goes with everything in life. Just get your lessons out of things and it will get better and I hope it will be the same for me maybe one day I will be really happy with my end results um, photography, videography wise but for now um, yeah, <laughs> it's something <laughs> <laughs> should about seeing me, you just want the free preset um, so yeah, maybe then give the video a like and subscribe because I try to do this on a weekly basis see you guys in the next one